Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Elden Ring here in Elphiel. I don't know why I can never remember that name. It's a cool name, Elphiel, Brace of the Hallow Tree, specifically at the Drainage Channel. There are our runes. We need to go pick them up. Um, just real quick, I did have a slight snafu. I was recording for a few minutes, and I had to cut that recording. Fortunately, I really didn't do anything other than a little bit of gear change and some upgrades. Basically, my internal capture card, which is an Elgato, it was flickering. And I didn't really feel comfortable going much further thinking that the recording might cut out. So I've restarted everything. Everything seems to be a-okay now. But what I did was, at all of your suggestions, I finally dumped Lusat's staff. I love it. I think it's great that I'm getting boosted damage. But really, it's I can offset it using the Graven Mass uh, Talisman and the Graven School Talisman. This is, let's see, a difference of 16 that's it, 16 scaling. Now this has, I think it's between 8 and 10% is what you're all telling me, but at a massive 50% more FP. So we're just going to go with the Carry and Regal Scepter. I did upgrade that to plus 10. Um, dagger, I want to go put my Misery Core back on there. That's up to 23 now. And I do ha still have the Carrying Glintstone Staff and the Staff of Loss in my other hands. So that is kind of the name of the game. You can see my stats over there on the right-hand side, level 141. So let us continue on. I kind of forgot that I had dropped all of my runes here. So let's go and grab those. It shouldn't be too bad. I, I just think that the level design here is really something special. It, I did it again. Doggone it, I did it. I did this when I was recording earlier and had to cut it. I My runes are up on that route. I heard someone describe this as an Orlando if they took more time. And yes, what a perfect description. This does feel like Anne Orlando could have been. When you first get to Anne Orlando and you take in that vista, it's truly just a jaw-dropping moment. It's it's amazing. Really, really and truly is. Oh, up here, that's why. And then when you get into it, yeah, it's still a good area, but it feels hollow. It feels a bit empty given its size. And um, it also just feels incomplete. Like you see all these buildings, but you can't do anything with it. I never did find that shortcut, by the way. I guess it's quite possible that uh, there's still more yet to come. Hmm. I think I could drop down there. But let's not risk it. Let's not risk it. Let's instead take this branch. So yeah, this is just, it feels fully fleshed out. And while I can't go in every single building, I can go in quite a few. I can go in a surprising number of them, and that's just that's really exciting to me. Just this sense of exploration, like someone who's never been here before just has complete freedom in terms of where we're going to go. Also, I mean, look at this. I'm still going. I could have dropped down. I could have gone to a new area. I can still go up. I think I want to go up. I feel like the game wants me to go down. Do I make that jump, though? I'm going to try it. Okay, there we go. Not too bad, not too bad. Keep going up, up, up. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe the game wants me... Wait, did I just loop back around? Is that all I did? I believe so. Okay. Well. Darn it, I have to go down here. I should have looked ahead to see if there was an item on this little pillar. And not here. And not there. Okay. So that was a risky jump for zero payoff. Understood. No pain, no gain, though. Not that I really had pain, but then again, I also didn't. Oh gosh! I didn't have a. Uh, I didn't have gain or pain. So drop down to get in there, which I think is probably what I want to do. Except I do want to get onto this rampart. Oh, I see a ladder. I see a ladder going how far down? All the way down. Yeah, I don't think I want to do that yet. Nope, we can remember that that's there. And then, you know me, I will subsequently forget that in about two seconds flat. In fact, I'm not even sure what I'm referencing right now. But we can go... I did see the hole in the roof, but first... Is there anything on this lower roof right here? Nope. And what do we have? 
we have a treasure surrounded by... It actually looks like it's those little... Yeah. So we have the big pests and then the little ones. So maybe they're not fully aquatic. So my whole diatribe about them being aquatic naiads is not exactly accurate. I'm afraid if I drop here... Well... Oh my. So they have magic too, huh? Great. Uh... Oh boy, they're not that date. Oh, if only I had my comet. You know what I do have, though? I do have Founding Reign of Stars. Okay. We're gonna have to try and make this work, then. Okay. And back up, back up, back up. You... Shows poorly. All right, I'm gonna have to go further out onto this walkway. There we go. There we go. Now walk away. Walk away. Walk away. Oh, you're killing me. You are absolutely killing. Me. All right, we know that these guys. Oh, they they have glowing eyes. That one has glowing eyes. That guy should go down in three or two or two. Never mind. Okay. Oh wow, look at how little Night Comet now costs. This is this is kinda nice. Oh, this is this is fantastic. How about Glimstone Comet Shard? That kills you. How about you? Will this reach? It sure will. Oh, beautiful. Alright, before we drop though, is there any Nope, looks like that's about it. Except from where? Oh. There's that one, and there's a big one down below. But we can deal with that after we drop. Okay. Come on, something good. Oh, I like that color. Dragon Crest Great Shield Talisman. Enormously boosts physical damage negation. Oh, okay. And that would stack with these because they're different names. It's not just a plus one. Okay. So same, same flavor text, but let's actually look at that. So we have, I'm currently at 137 for physical or 14, I think that's percent. Then I go up to 22 or 25 or 31. All right, that's actually really good to know. If I'm struggling with a physical damage boss, that's uh, that could be big. And let's see, how much damage is this gonna do? Not quite a two shot, that's okay. Three shot works for me. You, however, er, I don't know. We're, we're gonna actually try Comet here. There we go, there we go. That worked out very, very nicely. All right, get my FP back. I wonder if Knight Shard would one-shot you. It does, wow, you're very weak. No offense, you're just, you're very weak. <laughs> Okay, there's the item I could have dropped down to. Nascent Butterfly. Now, before we drop down, let's be smart about this. Let's run. Oh, never mind. I, I can't do that. So, we're just going to drop here. And assume... Alright, actually, this is clear. That, that looks like that goes down. So, we're going to ignore that. That might go out to the graveyard. safe holy moly that's a lot oh I wish I had my cannon look at how many there are that's just silliness good gravy all right well let's take it nice and slow in fact let's take it this way first because I think this way was more soldier based right if I can even... Oh, you're a big one. Can I? Oh, that would have been beautiful. Okay, 
Backstab. That is just not much. Oh boy. Cast it. Okay. Oh, don't get that shield up. Don't you- Oh. Backstab. I should probably go for a backstab, honestly. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I... He came up right behind me. All right. Well, I can get down there pretty quickly. I think I can avoid that entire... That entire building. Yeah, because I can just jump down to where that Aeonian butterfly was and then probably jump down there. I just need to be more aggressive with that knight. That's what that is. That's all that is. Oh, boy. You know, I saw, I think it was Illusory Wall had posted on his Twitter a breakdown of the enemy scaling by area. And yeah, Elphiel and Halleck Tree had, I believe it was the highest, the single highest enemy scaling in the game. Meaning, even though you may run into these enemies elsewhere, they will deal far, far, far more damage here than anywhere else if you encounter them in another area. Okay. So yeah, let's um, let's try that ag again. I I like starting with a backstab. Yeah, go ahead and patrol over this way. I gotta watch out for that pest. I don't even know where that one came from. Okay. There we go. So let's wait. go back up there we go back up he's gonna heal there it is okay beautiful misery cord you are just something special really and truly you are now okay just some regular enemies I think right oh gosh oh legit scared me That, that frightened me. <laughs> I am frightened. <laughs> Interesting how you pay no mind. Until I just walked up to you. Now there's a big one over there. So here's, here's the plan here. Because I at least need to take care of all the other ones. Okay, almost got him. Uh oh, I didn't realize that I couldn't just simply back up right straight behind me. That's all right. We will get my FP back. There we go. You're dead. Oh, 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 you have the same thing. All right, let's fight fire with fire. my dot. No, 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 no. Okay. We need to heal. Let's bait an attack. Okay. Still got it. Come on. You gotta break that guard. Back up, back up, back up. Ah. Uh. There we go. Ho, 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 ho. Okay. We got him, we got him, we got him. So what, um... Uh, another straight sword. I've heard people trying to farm for that and not getting anywhere, and I get them dropped all too frequently. Now, can I... Can't keep going down. So 
So what? I see the one soldier. Is that all there is? Because it's going to be real unfortunate. Here's what we're going to do. Something fancy, which means we're going to die. Very nearly right. Oh, look, this is actually kind of sad that they're just mourning. So I guess those who lost in the, in the Great War. Also, their blood's a weird color. I'm just noticing. That's a that's gonna be a tough night over there. Ooh, lots of lilies down there. That's a that's a night with a great bow. Are you a standard soldier? You are, but you have. Company, well, dealt with the easier or the harder one, rather. Okay, got you, Lord Sworn Shield. Neat. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna deal with him from up here. Oh, beautiful. Oh. Okay, I have to say for everyone recommending that I switch out Lusats, good call. I am saving so much in terms of FP. It's kind of silly. All right. Getting a little swampy down here. Fortunately, nothing's building up. Lots and lots of Mikola's lilies. Okay, we know that we had another archer somewhere coming up. It wouldn't be bad to actually start with a backstab, though. Oh, he's right here. Crud. Nope. I... Oh, and then you became that. That stinks. Death? Yeah. I just don't think that that's a good idea. He almost caught me with that. Did you just get knocked down? Whoa. Aha, he didn't kill me. I didn't think he would. I had a feeling he wasn't going to kill me. Always watch behind you. Not that you can actually do that or anything, but... Oh, man. Stinks. We were making such progress. I don't know what we're making progress to. I'm going to have to kill so many to get there. You know what? I just had an idea. An item that I haven't used at all, which is a shame because it's a really cool idea. Bewitching branch? Bewitching trig, twig? Can't speak. Yeah. I think it might be time we give that a shot. If we can get to one of those big ones... So, let's go ahead and put that on. I think we had some, right? Yeah, we have Bewitching Branch. Use FP to charm a pierced enemy. Question, how much can I just drop down and avoid some of these enemies? At least some of the more difficult ones. He's still over there doing his thing. If I can not, you know, not kill everything, that'd be, that would just be swell. Okay. This is somehow working. I don't know if it's going to be a good idea to go after that guy. Simply because, I mean, there's no one else around him. You know what? I don't think we should try and get fancy here. I think we should just simply... And hope that he doesn't pull out his sword and shield. There we go. And that's how you do it. 
You're a caster. You're a wizard, Harry. You're not, uh, you're not an assassin. Oh, and this is, this is really it. So this should be actually the last bit of loot that I really need here, I think. And it's, it's a hero's room? That's what I'm here for. Tell you what, since we're here. Hey, you, wake up. Hey, you, wake up. Why are you still after me? Why are you still after me? Did you really resist? Well, what was the point of that? Well, now we're in trouble. Now, mistakes were obviously made. And I am just running. We're just running. <laughs> oh my gosh. The sneak is, is too strong. <laughs> the sneak is too strong in this. Right, well, I guess we're okay. Yeah, we, how did that work? Anyway, anyway, I mean, how did that not work, first and foremost, and then how did that work as a follow-up? Stop running. Oh, oh, controller. What are you doing? Oh, I thought one of those would kill you. There's so many. There's the ladder. Uh, we do have someone looking over. That kind of stinks. That's going to be a bit of a problem. Can I kill you? Let's try it without alerting the other one. Oh. Oh. Okay. This was, this was unexpected. Controller, please start working. <gasps> oh gosh. My inputs are completely not being read. Oh, I, yeah. See, I would never... Oh gosh. This is a problem. There's not much I can do here. I have to reboot the controller. Bear with me. Okay. Controller should be off here momentarily. It's not. There it is. Disconnected. Okay. And now reconnected. And I think we're back in business. <laughs> Please. I don't want to record in the attic anymore. Alright. I can break line of sight with the tree. Okay, good. You're dead. The other one is very, very weak. So all I need to do, one little night chart is going to do it. Okay. There we go. Beautiful. Target this one. Okay. Wide, wide arc. Get all the way around. Th that's not who I want to target. There we go. There might be another big one down below. I don't know. Gotcha. There is a big one. It would be great if that guy just walked directly underneath. Would you? How? Okay, that works. Uh, another big one right there, but I can get him from the cliff. I'm afraid of the one in the balcony. Okay, stand up. Got it. I need the one, mm, I need the one whose butt's up in the air. Okay. I think 
think I'm okay to drop down. Go oh! Number three, okay. And what, what is that? Seven, eight, and nine, wow. I can nearly max out all of my uniques. That's, that's exciting. This, this might, that's actually the big one, I think, right? So stand up. Uh-oh. Quickly, get, get the other one off. Okay. Okay, we're still okay. That's a little one. The big one, though, is really right above me all right this is okay oh! no! it was going so well and if I just healed the full oh okay I have an idea <laughs> I have an idea how we can avoid most of that, right? And, um, yeah, okay, all right. Here's what we're gonna, there's just a little bit of loot there, right? That's it, there's just a little bit of loot and then that area's done. I have 200,000 runes riding on it though. Here is what we are going to do. We are going to get a spell on, okay? We're going to drop this Loretta's... I'm sorry, Loretta's Mastery, you are just straight garbage, unless I don't know how to use you, and then I'm the straight garbage. That's probably accurate. We're going to go in there all invisible-like, right? I'm going to use the ladder to get up close and personal, and then I'm going to put on, check this out, a sacrificial twig on my Cerulean Amber Medallion a number two. I should have a bunch of these. I do. This is going to prevent us, if we do die... If we do die, this will prevent us from losing the runes that are on the ground, or at least that's how the sacrificial rings, or the rings of sacrifice rather, worked in the Dark Souls games. So that's kind of what I'm aiming for. That's what I'm hoping for. So we're going to take this up onto the roof. We're not dropping down. We are instead going to, oh, the ladder's over yonder, which means I shouldn't have jumped down. Can I easily get back up? No? Well, then, phooey. Did I really goof that up? I don't want to make that jump. I gotta get back on that branch. Come on, now. Oh, wow. That was surprising. Did I have to make that? No, that just brings me back instead. Oh, criminy. Okay. Ugh. Oh, what? The ladder's up there. Okay. What do now? Get onto this roof. I mean, getting onto that balcony does me zero good. No benefit whatsoever. So how do I... Okay. <sighs> Jeepers. Okay. Let's try this again. I want my runes. I want that loot. I don't... Oh, controller's acting up again. Do I... Is this... I have to make this jump? <gasps> no, 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 no. I don't think I can do it with the controller like this. That just walked me right off. I assure you that is... That is not me. You know what? It's probably safer just to do this. Just to hop down. And to start going. Alright. Here goes something. I don't know. For a little more protection... Oh, you're already just seeing right through it. Runes first. 
It's a new man's round. You know what? That's okay, because guess what? I got my runes. So what do you go down there? Okay, the bell bearing is important. The bell bearing is important. Everything else is not, though. Kind of... Oh, beautiful. I, I wasn't sure what that message was, but now I am excited. Right, well, that was stressful. That was stressful. So let's run without spending the, the runes, right? Isn't that how we do it here? The Blue Lizard Jello channel. All right, get some vigor going. Get some vigor going. Um, yeah, I need to go and uh, take some deep breaths, do a little bit of breathing exercise. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching, <laughs> and I'll see you next time.